Are you just beginning your Etsy journey and trying to find the best keywords for your listings? Or maybe you're new to E-Rank and you wanna see what you can accomplish with this tool. Well, today we're gonna to dive into the keyword tool as a free user and see what we can accomplish. Let's get started. So once we're logged into our account, we'll go to keyword research and keyword tool. If you're following along in March, 2025, we have a new version of the keyword tool that's currently in beta and we're going to use that version because eventually that's going to be the main keyword tool. So Easter is coming up. Let's say we have some personalized Easter baskets. So let's type in personalized Easter basket and hit enter. And first thing we're going to see is the keyword statistics for the keyword personalized Easter basket. We have average searches at 841. We have average clicks at 872. And we have a low medium competition rate of 22,735. Next, we're gonna see the search trend graph. And since this is a seasonal keyword, you can see the spike in searches during February and March. Over here, we will have searchers by country and Overwhelmingly, uh, the searches are United States and I'm searching from the United States, so that makes sense. Down here is where we're gonna get some keyword ideas to see keywords that are relevant to our initial search of personalized Easter basket. So if we scroll down here, we're gonna see keywords that are related to our search of personalized Easter basket. Our first one in the list is the keyword that we searched, and then below are other keywords that are related to this keyword and this can give you some great ideas for additional keywords to add to your listing. Unfortunately with the free version we don't get the full data set uh, to each keyword but this isn't going to prevent you from searching some of these keywords independently to see some data on them. And we can go through hundreds of keywords that are relevant to the keyword that we searched. If we jump over to near matches, we're gonna see keywords that are near the keyword that we typed. So we typed personalized Easter basket. We're gonna see personalized Easter baskets, plural, Easter basket personalized, and so on. Next, we have SERP analysis, and that's SERP stands for search engine results page. Here, we're going to see how many listings were analyzed in this search, the average price of products that were included in that search, the average hearts, total views, average views, average daily views, and average weekly views. We also have a tag cloud here that shows us our most popular tags relevant to the keyword that we searched. We can see the categories that these products fall into. And since I said this is a seasonal item, um, seasonal decor is of course gonna be the highest ranking of the categories that these are listed in. We've got our price range in a bar chart so we can see where these products lie. So the majority of these products are lying in the $14 area and the $23 area. And then over here we can see the processing time and this shows us how quickly sellers are getting these products out the door. And it looks like between one and two days is overwhelmingly the um, processing time for the products that were anal analyzed. Next, we can go over to top listings, and this will show us the top listings from the search results. So here we see this one that is an Easter basket label for kids, personalized Easter basket tab tag. We can see the tags that were included in this listing, and we can also click a star, and that allows us to save that tag to our list, and we can manage our list and add new lists right from here. And then we can go down and continue to see popular or top listings for this search. We also have the age of the listing here, total views that the listing had. We have daily views, estimated sales, and on this first one is zero, on this one it is six. Um, and then we have the estimated revenue for all of these products. This can kind of give you a good uh, idea of how these products are performing and how your product may perform as well if it's relevant to these products. And lastly, we have the popular marketplaces section. Here we're gonna see Etsy. That's our main marketplace that we're analyzing results from, but we also can get data from 
other marketplaces if you are shopping on these marketplaces. You can also get an overall idea of how popular this keyword might be in the broader market. And that is a quick look at the free version of eRank's keyword tool. Hopefully this was helpful to give you some insight on how you can improve your listings and become a more successful Etsy seller.